about it. I'm not buying on the fence. I'll probably buy about four pairs of trainees, even though he's got nine pairs with him. I have like six. Yeah, you mad bastard. Best day, done a little jog this morning, so just on float now. Water loading started today, so I need a piss to be honest. Daddy. Time and fella. Want to take a picture? Appreciate it, buddy. Yeah, man. Have a good one. I've got too many clothes on. I get supplied enough by Liverpool based brands. Some funky wheels here in America, mate. Thought so those funky ones by ours. Some of the worst trainers I've ever seen in my life, lad. You're a shopaholic. In England, that'd be a lot more. Would it? Yeah, they'll be shopping in this section soon. I'm literally shaking. Holy fuck. It's nice to just get out the house and have a little walk around, like, to be honest. It's nice to just get to chill, have a little float. The only thing is, when you're walking around, you can just smell food. You can just smell food everywhere. I'm starting water loading now, so just got the weight cut this week, make weight, and we're flying, aren't we? Make weight, the hard part's done, and it's the easy part. Watch the fight pass invitation or watch some grappling. Pass some time. I'm excited for the press conference. Everyone is. <laughs> the moment that got me down on some DVD for Christmas. And the first one I watched live was Richard Rampage. Like the first one I watched week by week. Yes, be let on. Give us a thumbs up, big scouser. Thank you. 292 pounds, like Brock Lesnar. I was 21, the highest I could get to was like 85 key. I'm gonna fucking try and get out of the way. They come this way, please, obviously. I won't be fighting Tony Ferguson next week if these big bastards land on me, will I? We're getting Good. skinny patty today. You know I'm that. Adina, yeah. Right. I think I Oh, was the people at home watching it like yes. this? Yep. Yeah, there's all other people stood there. Yeah, that's mad, that. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> that's a, that's <laughs> over that. That's a belt there. Yeah. There's like a camera up there and you're watching it VR. There's people next to you in the crowd. It's like you're sitting in the crowd. Nice to watch, you know what I mean? Helps pass the time on a Sunday as well when I'm waterloading. So back the house now, last little bit of food, and then we're moving to the Fighters Hotel tomorrow. Can't wait to get the weight, weight made, eat some proper food, and then beat Tony up. A short sessions now, more than ten. Some pads and stuff, and then we'll do like like a fight run too. Know what I mean? Feel great, man. It's gonna be an easy weight cut, and a lot of you will have noticed over watching the vlogs and seeing pictures and videos of me. My body is completely different to what it was a year ago. Even the Jared Gordon fights, my body is completely different. I've got muscles on my neck and that now. It's mad. And he's just made clear level ups here, and I think you just see it. He's just finished Ellis three times in two minutes. Mad one, proper mad one. One of my mates got on me saying, uh, Tony's on his way to Vegas, lad. I was like, How oh, is he? Yeah, give us a look. Trying to get him. Up on Instagram and he's not there. I mean there's fan pages and a random Tony Ferguson. But he's not there, lad. NXT, that what it is. Lad, he must have blocked me, lad. Must have blocked me. That way of being tagged in something with him, yeah, look. No posture. What the fuck? What have I done to you, Tony? Yeah. Showed you nothing but respect, bro. What's up, this? What's up to you, you know that man, bro. You know that's sick now. How's it going as well, lad? Uh, I think Tony's dangerous early, just like he's shown in all his last six fights. And then he loses, then Patty wins. Just think that, like I said, Tony, Tony's you know dangerous early, and then he seems to slow down. But it was a good fight for Patty. Six now and dead. Nice start. And I haven't finished war loading yet. Still drank eight liters yesterday. Flat buying, as they say by ours. Absolutely flat buying. Probably dropping another little three pound or something more like that. And have to do like ten pound. Have a great day. Nice shot and chill later. Some little fruit. We call that jelly. Yankee Doodle Dandies call that yellow. And a little bit of yogurt on top. And then 
a little bit of chicken with some satay sauce, grilled steak. Yeah, that's, that's all I'm on. People think this life of a fight is all luxurious. It's not. Eat them all day. <laughs> Good day lad Jared, it's nearly 2 o'clock, gotta go to the presser up just after 4. A little half an hour tops probably, raise the heart rate and that before they do the weight cut later. A B E, Berry Berry, get yours now. Nice that. Same as what it was before, and I haven't, I've eaten, drank, I haven't done any fucking cut yet. Best I've ever felt, lad. I've never, I've never felt like this. I've never been able to do a workout like that on a um, weight cut day. You know what I mean? Feel fresh, feel alive. Normally a little bit more depleted than this. I've got energy to, to do little workouts like that with Alice on weight cut day. It's going to be an easy one, this. Last supper. Twenty minutes in the bath, get a proper sweat on, and then I'll jump in the, the towels for twenty minutes, and then chill here for twenty minutes. Just cycle it. This is the hard part. Just gotta be mentally strong enough to do this. Can't wait to weigh in tomorrow, and I can't wait to fucking beat it more once after that. That's probably his best cut. No distractions this week. Absolutely on it. All done. He'll make weights in the morning. Won't have to do anything. So yeah, great. No, the watch is doing spinnies around my arm. Oh, Spencer okay. pulled me key card out of my pocket, lad, and my ring just went woo. Started rolling across the casino floor. Are we going to a Denny's or an IHOP? Now it's time for some carbs. Nah, I need to smother that on that last driver. Nice, maybe 175. Yeah, obviously we, we've depleted our body of carbohydrates and salt. That was the main thing that we wanted to get back on our body today. That's why Paul Reed and the Carmines had us with garlic bread, lasagna, spaghetti meatballs. Get that spaghetti meatballs down here please. Ad. A belly full of food. No, well, it can't be about 180 lad. We went in and there, didn't we? Put on 24 pound. 12 pound of that is just water, getting liquids and rehydrating and stuff. But yeah, put 24 pound on. I am ready to go. Tune in tomorrow night. But when you're watching this tonight, and you never know, you might be watching it in the future when I've already finished, Tony.